This afternoon, a judge upheld a restraining order to keep county prosecutors from enforcing Michigan's decades-old abortion ban. News Ace Megan Bunchman joins us in studio now with more on today's hearing. Megan? Brian and Sue, the continuing temporary restraining order comes after the Court of Appeals ruled Monday that the injunction of Michigan's 1931 abortion ban did not apply to county prosecutors. During today's hearing, those against the restraining order argued that Michigan's Constitution does not provide a right to abortion. While well, Governor Whitmer's team said by lifting the order, more confusion and chaos would ensue. Kent County's prosecutor is one of the defendants in this case. Um, I'm upset about the process of what the governor and the attorney general have done in terms of, you know, running to favorable courts and seeking judges that are favorable to them. You know, I, I'm all for the legal process and I'll follow a, a validly issued injunction. Uh, I'm not trying to be a rogue prosecutor. I'm concerned about my 12 year old rape victim that won't know whether or not she can go to a medical professional and end that pregnancy because it was a result of rape. I'm concerned about women who are confused and the chaos that's going to cause. And it's not, it's not mere confusion. It, it's, it's affecting a very vulnerable population and women everywhere. Now, the restraining order will remain in place until August 17th. That's two weeks from now when a preliminary injunction hearing is scheduled. Brian.